Everybody, it's your boy Wendigo. You already know. Back at it with some Walking Dead, season one, episode one. We're in the drugstore right now. We just got a call on the walkie from Glenn. He's trapped in a motorhome in an ice box, surrounded by walkers. So. Me and Carly, our dead-eyed girl that saved us in our last episode, we're going to be headed over there in a few. So, um, without further ado, I hope you enjoy. Let's get into it. Hey, Carly. Hey, Carly. So, uh... It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. Like, I know those batteries were good. I know you I know you pressed the on button. Please tell me you put them in correctly. Bro. We love Carly. We love Carly. We love Carly. I'm not gonna let her live this one down. Nope. I think not. As the unknown affliction continues to spread on the estimated death toll continues to skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay indoors and avoid any contact with individuals you suspect may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full uh, my, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. God bless you all. Not Steve. Jeez. Um, are you okay? Hey there. That radio sign off didn't sound too good. Are you okay? I'm fine. You don't have to be. It's traumatic. I'm sure some people got out. Maybe they're all being rescued. Then again, maybe not. So you ready? You ready to head out? You got it. You? Oh yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Let's get her up pushing. City. Did you see that? Sorry, I'm getting some some text messages. Let me put that on. Ready to shoot. Guys, oh, oh man. I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. All right, then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me. And I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. Can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal. Over a girl. I'm saving her. With or without you. Think Jeez. about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. Oh, man. I really hope it's not like that, Glenn. You're thinking wrong, bro. All right, let's get let's let's give Glenn the benefit of the doubt. 
You know, he, he just wanted to help. Okay, this is the plan. You don't know how hard it's gonna be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's four to nine. So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. Noise attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. Alrighty then. Let's see what's, what we're dealing with. Seems alright. Okay, there we go. there mm. oh what do I spy with my little eye something nice a pillar yoink good luck smothering them to death that's not really what I have in mind but it is an option. So, uh... Let's keep looking around. You need to find a weapon. So... They're basically just... Alright, I got you. Alright, well, um... Ooh, let's Get smother him. The noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Oh. Improvised silencer. That was sick! Here, big boy. It was awesome. <laughs> My friend, you have been pinned. Let's turn this Wait. into paper. Let me see the spark plug. Porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. Hmm. Now you know. You heard nothing. Been acquired. That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Huh, I was thinking sunny side up, but you know, that works too. In the way. Alright, let's try this a different way. Uh. 
Hmm. Um. I don't know how to feel about that one. Come hither. And jump. Whoa. Well, that one works. Sloppy aim. What? He thought I forgot about you. Not. Ooh. Okay then. Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice pick sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's Gnarly. cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? I don't know. Are you? No I'm more. thinking. That should help. Here's Lee. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. Um, that's what lag behind kind of means. Or, you know, is insinuated. So, uh, come here, Walker. Here, Walker, 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 Walker. Ooh. Down with bloody big head. Rat. Hello. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please, Nobody go home. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. Wait. Do we have to? I'll huff and I'll puff. Coming out. You're hurt. Oh God. I, I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? Mm. I told you. I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? When? I don't Dang want that. Dang. It's not Christian. Please. Just leave me. Please go. Why, Glenn? Uh. Okay. We'll leave. Just... Try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. Give it to her. What? You can't be serious. Do it. No! Then shoot her. Huh? I've seen what hell is like and it's coming back as one of those things! Shoot her! Help her out here. You're insane! Just take Just this thing! Like, since you don't want to do it, like... Pretty sure Thank she'll, you like, so much. I know how terrible this must be. We can't Try watch this. this. Let's go. We can't go yet. What? Why not? Because somebody needs to pick up the gun. Can't leave it. You two go on. Okay. Um, everybody look away. I'm here with you. You're a good man. I guess. I don't really feel like it. 
uh, sheet and I don't know I, like I'm pretty sure this is the outcome for every situation so um everyone all right yeah we had some close calls but Glenn is fine and well yeah we're okay I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Jeez, man. So, uh, hey, Clem. Are, are, are you good? Like, let's check on our Clementine. How's your finger, finger Clem? Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. I know I'm not your dad, but if you need anything, I'm your guy, okay? Okay. Same. You're my guy? Oh, no. You know. <laughs> We're gonna try to take care of each other. Yes. Deal. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. Bum bum be dum bum bum be dum bum. Snatch that up. Yoink. Hey, Glenn, are are you good? How you doing, Glenn? You know. Uh, I don't know, but I guess I do. What's your story, Glenn? I deliver pizzas around here. I brought a couple to the Everts a few times. Sorry, I mean the folks that own this place. Just really good people. It sucks seeing this place like this. Isn't that the truth? So Lee's last name is Everett. Lee Everett. Back to the motor in. How can it be that bad so fast? You know, when things are taken away, people do crazy shit. I guess, but that's not me. I'm not giving up, not for anything. Good, man, good. You let her do it, you know. You said give her the gun. I know I did. Why the hell would you do that? Mercy, man. I couldn't let her go on like that. We couldn't. You never know. You can't give up hope. I think it was over for her, Glenn. She was bitten her torso, Glenn. She didn't want to become a zombie. It's logical. Or at least how I feel about it, you know. Pretty sure somebody in the comments gonna tell me different, so. Go ahead, fill them up, baby. Let's see, let the comments roll. Okay, so, um. What's your next move? I don't know. I mean, you guys seem okay. What about your family? Yeah, I. I. Forget it, man. That's your business. I hate feeling like I can't do anything. I know the feeling, man. Try to get some rest. Huh. Yeah, right. Here. I found some snacks. I'm cool. Not much of an appetite. Maybe save it for one of the kids? I have fed all the kids. Shut up and eat the food! Somebody was able to leave the dinner table when they were little. Here. I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, uh, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. Lee just made it sound like she was like a puppy dog or something like that. Keep her fed and watered. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Sure. sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. Dun 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 dun. The man's Jesus. got a resting B face. 
Are you good, dog? They just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all we care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. More than 400 days. Ah, 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 ah. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. We just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Universal Did remote, you do anything boy. With this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. I just hope the power's still on. Can you know? You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Everybody's got their clicks. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? I got a few of them to take notice. But not That's enough. So... Yeah. Awesome. <clears throat> now to distract those things carefully. Open sesame. Well, I've done all I can do. <clears throat> I'm about to eat this brick all the way over there. Himself would be happy. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Oh, hey, bud. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So, yeah, I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry I wasn't here. But knowing you are, Take care of him, come on. That helped. Oh man, let it be a one hit wonder. He's terminated. Hmm? She's she's gotta do it real quick. Like, Oh man, well, won't you just die? Oh man. Oh, little bro. I love you. 
Oof. Oh, we know the head is where you need to hit it. God. So, uh, in your pockets, boy. There we go. Holy crap! Run! <laughs> like, I just burn them all to me. Quick, throw the rest of that lock on there. It'll buy us like five minutes. No, like, come on now. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. E big brain. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. Am I? Am I really amazing? You, know, you have not been the nicest of her people. Gotta hurry. Run, boy, run. Man, what are the chances? No, through the land, darkness was coming. Well, somebody had bad aim. Hey, did I stab her? At least she got a weapon at that, so just pop it off and yoink! Stab her real quick. Come on, baby, time Straight to go. Shank. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round back! No, it's fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dealing, Dallion. Bro, I just need to duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Nice, that door's not locked anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. This is no good. Hey Lee, if we don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. Um, thanks? Gee, thanks, Doug! Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know... I should know what? Huh? You said I should know... Shit! Are you sure? Shit! Oh, shit! Okay, then. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. You won't come in. Clementine, can you find anything? Nothing. Wait. That window is screwed. Go. Keep on knocking, but you can't come in. Nope. I found something. Atta girl. Thank you, Bob. Oh, man. She has a gun, but no bullets. That's why she's going for a purse for another clip. He's only, like, tech savvy. Uh. Carly. Don't look, Clem. Don't look. Oh my God. Let's go. Could have been you. 
you got done. Oh, uh uh. Nope. Off her. Off. What? Oh, you fell for that. That was my face. My snarl. I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. Especially a good friend. Thank you, Kenny. Oh, look at that. Kenny is that man, bro. Kenny is is the boss. The boss man. He is her. Larry, that guy, bro. Come on. Got to stick up him. So far, he needs to like use tweezers to pick it out. Yeah. Walker Gook. It's never yummy. Poor people. Everybody just trying to survive. Hey, Glenn. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Everything we own would be lost if I left you alone for five minutes. She really gonna tell him he can't go? Find your friends. Be safe. Thanks, Lee. That means a lot. I don't mean to abandon you all, but this seems like an okay setup, and I'm sure things will be back to normal around here in no time. Let's hope. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. I think they go from upstairs. Are you just gonna let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. Makes a fair point. Alright, Glenn, be safe. We love you, Glenn! Did you check the glove box? I swear I saw it earlier. You never pay attention to where you leave things. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. I think you know what you're doing. Shit, man, do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures things out. That girl's gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. You the man, bro. You the man. I love Kenny. Kenny is like... Kenny is a main character that... That you're gonna you're gonna see and like keep track of his mental like you'll see it either deteriorate rapidly or slowly slowly but it, it really shows like the type of like mental anguish that people are going through and like what can possibly cause 
the actions. You never pay attention to way you leave things. Okay. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Oh, yeah? I'm sorry, Carl. It's okay. Thanks, though. There's been a lot of death in the past few days. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Yeah. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. You saved me. I thought you needed the help. Ah, that makes sense. But it wasn't a choice like that. It, it was just something I did. I don't know why. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Yeah, but you don't always get the best of both worlds, love. Better learn that now. Like, it's an apocalypse. If you haven't already learned it, now's a better time than any. You got lots of food. Should be good for a minute. Oh man, Duck is just chewing her ear off. Oh man, check this out. The Jumatron had this minigun on his shoulder. It's all like pow, pow, pow. I thought Super Dinosaur was toast. But you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then. Hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Dang, we should have... Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense. But it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. I can fix Lee, it. come here for a second. Let me go deal with this. Oh, man. Clementine, another thing. Jeez. What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me, so... Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. Yeah, hey, Lee, do you have a second? It's an apocalypse. I have many. My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor in's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Heck yeah. Glass half full. Wait a minute. Hold on now. See Quinn. She running. She like Lee. I scared of the dark. She's. I was scared of the dark for like till I was seven. Terrified. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. 
How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers mm -hmm. don't worry me as much as the bandits. You fuck with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! You never liked my dad. Even back at the drugstore whenever we thought Kenny's kid was fit, you went out of your way to side against him. But I loved him. Happening. I kissed his fist. I'm ah. No more, please. No more, please. Please, please. <laughs> 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 Okay, let's see how honesty lie to Herschel. You and excuse me, let me stop. You and four fifty four percent of players were honest. You know, honesty is the best policy. Like, shoot, truth hurts. Like what? Off of the labyrinth, like truth hurts, little girl. Hurts like H. Hurts like H. You know what I'm talking about. Anyways, um. But, you know, sometimes it's better. Because then you get roped in a, you know, just a web. Who would you save? Duck or Sean? Like, you know, Sean, Sean saved, helped save us. But, Duck is a kid, man. It's a child. If anything, at the very least, he's got more years. He can develop. He can grow. And. Bro can like. Observe and learn. Faster than an adult possibly could. You know. Maybe. You know. That, that may be a little stretch. But. Eh. Why do you think we teach our young. You know. And then. And then like. We throw. Throw people. You know. Adults out into the real world. Anyways. So, you and 52% 50 of players chose Duck. Loyalty. I'm a very big on loyalty. Very big. Sided with Kenny. You and 54 of players defended Kenny. Mercy. Gave Irene the gun. You and 47% of players gave her the gun. E yeah, like my thing is, is you know, right now the worst possible thing in this world at all, in my opinion, would be to turn into a walker. You know, that that's just it's no good. It's no bueno. So, uh. It's kind of where I went with that. Who would you save? Doug or Carly? You and 49% of players chose Carly. Now, the reason I chose Carly is because Carly took Walker out. That was in my face trying to eat me. Now, where Doug. Yes, he's tech savvy, which is a very big bonus, extremely good, don't get me wrong, but, I don't know, you know, like, being good with a gun and a reporter, those are some good qualities to have, good skills, you know, so, but mainly what weighed my choice with not even looking at Doug is Carly saved me. So she'd be a a benefit instead of a hindrance. Well that's it for us. That's it for today. You know who it is, it's Wendigo. And uh 
see you in the next episode. Signing off. Bye-bye.